video is called the lionfish. They are an invasive species in the Gulf with no natural predators. Fox News reporter Will Robinson Smith caught up with a group of local leaders who are working to find a solution to the harmful fish. Beneath the calm waters of the Gulf Coast, there's a species of fish that's causing fishermen to stop and take notice. It was really been an anomaly until the last year. See a few here, a few there, and we'd be like, hey, there's a cute lionfish. Well, about a year ago, I started seeing vast numbers of them, and it really alarmed me. I, in some reefs, there are more lionfish than any other fish observable. What's alarming is that the poison in their spines mean lionfish don't have natural predators. They also consume at an alarming rate. They're voracious eaters. They eat uh, up to 20 to 30 times of their uh, what a normal fish would eat in a day. Which, according to the Gulf Coast Lionfish Coalition, may cause trouble for local fishermen and tourists if left unchecked. If snapper are competing for li with lionfish for, for food or juvenile snapper are being eaten by these lionfish, then it's only a matter of time before that's that's a problem. 15, 20 years down the road, if you keep these fish keep eating the babies, there's not going to be anything out there on the reefs. And it's going to spread into the bays and, and the bios too because these fish can go anywhere. The group is now working to educate the public about lionfish and will hold tournaments and derbies to try and help reduce the population. The Floribama Yacht Club is also trying another solution, serving them on the menu. Right now we're just experimenting with it and, uh, and then in turn serving it for free to our guests. So it's been fun. It's really cool. The chefs here hope that this culinary solution will help solve the problem. Reporting at the Floribama Yacht Club, I am Will Robinson Smith mm. for Fox 10 News. Cook them up. The Floribama Yacht Club's Lionfish Derby will take place from May 1st through the 4th. For more information on the Lionfish, head over to our website, fox10tv.com.